So today I'm going to show you guys how to make a super simple Professor Trelawney costume. This is a great one to make if you just need a really quick and easy costume for Halloween or a convention coming up. So I wasn't able to find a long green shirt, so I just used a green shirt and a green dress that will go under it. And so I didn't even bother sewing these together. Um, basically, I'm just going to wear the green dress right under the green shirt, and I'll probably flip the green shirt backward as well um, because I didn't like the v-neck on it, but this is what it looks like so far. Slightly different colored greens, but it gives me the ruffle at the bottom. And then I just added some purple leggings. Then I cut a dark strip out of another green skirt, and that's just going to get sewn to the bottom of that green dress right along the ruffle line. And it'll be all the way around. So there's what that looks like. And then I took a yellow chartreuse kind of scarf, and that will just get sewn to the bottom of that dark green piece all the way around, just like that. I think she also had another piece below that, but I stopped here because I'm starting to get a little long. So then I just took some random necklaces and stuff, and a fringe scarf. It's a different color, but it did have the fringes, so I used it. And to put that on your head, it's pretty simple. You just put the center across your forehead, Pull it around your head, cross it under the under your hair on the back side of your head, and then just pull it back up top and tie it in place. And so then you end up with this, and my hair will eventually cover that up a little better. So for the glasses, I just took a piece of cardboard, and I traced a couple of circles, and then I cut those out of the cardboard. So I had two of them. And then I drew some inner circles on each one and cut those out with a utility knife and then pop the circles out so there's the rims of my Trelawney glasses I took some wood grain duct tape you could also just use brown paint but I had this on hand and it looked a little better than plain brown I thought so I just wrapped that around each of the pieces of cardboard So there's both of them once they're all covered in duct tape. And I did the same thing with a little piece for a nose piece. I kind of bent it and then I just attached it to the two circles with some more of that duct tape. Just taking a piece and going all the way across, wrapping it around both of the circles. So there's the main part of the Trinley glasses. And I took some wreath wire and I wrapped a piece of that, one on each side of the frames like that, and then I covered those up with some more of that wood grain duct tape all the way down to hide the wire. So there's those, worst looking pair of glasses ever. So for the hair, I jumped in the shower to get my hair wet. <gasps> How rude! And then while it was still wet, I put it into two really high pigtail braids on either side of my head, just like kindergarten. And then once they dried, took out the braids and then it gives me that nice fluffy Professor Trelawney type hair. Just gotta puff it out a little bit to get the nice Trelawney look. And together we shall cast ourselves into the future! Whoa! I think I cast myself a little too far into the future!